A new visitor center will be opening at the building that until recently was the home of Five Seasons Lily Pulitzer alongside the roundabout in Manchester. It's the next step at filling the gap left behind by the closing of the Manchester and the Mountains Regional Chamber of Commerce when it shut its doors last year. At the select board meeting on Tuesday, April 25th, the visitor center, set up by the new Manchester Business Association, was described by Anthony McLaurin, a Manchester resident and business association member who is helping with their marketing efforts. The center aims to open on Memorial Day weekend and run through mid-October. Our theme will be Experience Manchester. Uh, we have had superb support from our local community and businesses. We have all the furnishings that we need for the property, free of charge. Uh, and we'll be adding some new photography and some new ideas to make it slightly different from what we've maybe seen in the past. Uh, our intention is to open from 10 to 5, 7 days a week. Uh, but that will depend very much on the coverage that we get uh, to cover the site. McLaurin talked with Gina at the following day about the purpose and goals of the Visitor Center. The Visitor Center will be manned by volunteers. So we are a volunteer-only organization. We're also trying to make the uh, center experience Manchester. So we're about the lifestyle. We're about marketing all assets that we have in the Manchester uh, town and area, whether it be three ski mountains, three or four golf courses, the beautiful hiking that we have, fishing, shooting, retail shopping, the beautiful hospitality facilities that we have. We're focused on attracting our visitors to that. The Business Association plans a digital marketing outreach and will display brochures from both Manchester and area businesses based on space availability and with priority given to Manchester businesses. The Visitor Center will be sharing space with the ITV Fest, a television festival that will be coming to Manchester for the first time this October. Carolyn Blitz of Mountain Media, which publishes Stratton Magazine and Manchester Life, described the collaboration with the ITV Fest. We think that having the ITV Fest in Manchester is a terrific opportunity to bring visitors to the town. And um, Philip Gilpin, who is the uh, president of ITV Fest, is anxious to get the word out to the local community to also so people know what's going on. So that's why we partnered with the Visitor Center, with the MBA's Visitor Center initiative, to really have a place where people could come and find out about not only Art Manchester or other things that are happening in town, but also what's happening in the future, things like ITV Fest. But the Visitor Center won't be the only new pop-up joining the streetscape of Manchester this summer. The Southern Vermont Arts Center is partnering with Mountain Media and several commercial property owners who are offering currently vacant storefronts for use as exhibition space and temporary art galleries. Dubbed Art Manchester, the showcase period will run from June to Labor Day weekend and will provide opportunities for local artists to display and sell their works. Lana Halbin of Manchester Designer Outlets is one of the commercial property owners donating space, not only for Art Manchester, but the new Visitor Center building as well. Everybody has been thinking, and especially people like Carolyn Blitz, who I admire and respect, what can we do to make the town vital when stores are closing and there's economic distress in the world? Uh, we talked about uh, festivals. One of them is the Food and Wine Festival. The other, um, Carolyn called me up one day and said, you know, I want to do an arts festival. What do you think? I said, it's great. It's great. And, uh, and then spaces became available from our side and other landlords in town. And Carolyn said, you know, what if I go and try on behalf of the Arts Center to fill these spaces with the work of, of local artisans. And I think it's a great idea. And she is a, a very dynamic woman and we're really lucky to have her. So I think let's take lemons and make lemonade out of it. An opening reception for the Visitor Center will be held on May 25th. Businesses interested in having their brochures displayed should contact the Manchester Business Association at the manchestervermont.com website. For the GNAT TV News Project, I'm Andrew McKeever.